No can do. I took an arrow to the neck and I've been bleeding out for three rounds. And I just failed my third death check. Ugh. If only our healer hadn't died at the beginning of the fight because he doesn't know how to play his character. Again. Face it, Monica. Your boyfriend sucks at gaming. Surrender, elf. Your party is smoked. They're all dead. And you could probably thank your crappy healer for that. We're done here. Get out of my house! That was fun. You're getting better. Ish. And if we're gonna get married... We are going to get married. It's not that simple. If you don't understand gamers, you can't understand me. That's fine. But did you have to be such a dick to our latest former Game Master? He insulted you and he broke character just to do it! Which I deserved. My characters do suck and I'm not having any fun. Look, it may just be difficult for you to grok at first, but you just haven't had your breakthrough moment yet. Having that dire ant eater suck out my eyeballs was nowhere near a breakthrough moment. It was super cool, though. It was super cool. We'll worry about it later. We'll worry about what later? You have to be at work tonight. So I'll see you tomorrow night. Can I bring the Zoro costume? It's Power Ranger night. Mm -hmm. Fine, you can bring the mask. Mm -hmm. I'll see you later. can't help you this second. We're in the middle of Fight Club. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry, we're in the middle of... Ugh. Knitting Club! Ugh. Seriously? I'm sorry, I panicked. I should go. <laughs> yeah, um... I'm afraid that's not gonna be possible. <laughs> you see, uh, Leo over here has just broken the first two rules of, uh, Knitting Club. So, uh, he's our brother. We can't really punish him. And you have seen too much. I'm a bleeder! They're foam. Defend yourself. <gasps> yeah. Can you, sorry. Right. Hello? Aha. Uh -huh. I see. Knitting club dismissed. Pack your bag, Leo, we're going to Canada. Why would we go to Canada of all places? I mean, look, I know, I told you my girlfriend lives there, but I thought it was universally understood that she is completely pretend. My sister lives there. Yes, Monica, so what? So, she's getting married. Oh. Or so she thinks. You seriously think you can break them up by gaming with them? Doesn't matter what I think, all right? This guy is not a gamer, all right? He'll never pass the trial. The trial? Simple, Leo. Wombas marry gamers, period. No exceptions. Why do you think that I'm still single? Because you look like David Tennant had a baby with a balding ferret. Look, either he passes the trial or he doesn't marry my sister. This guy has no idea who he's messing with. Just promise me that I won't show up to your place one day and be all, hey, nice couch. Is that leather? Uh, no. 
It's the skin from the Canadian guy I gamed with last year. I make no promises, unless you come with me. Who's gonna run the store if I go with you? The fat guy. Who's gonna run the store if I go with you? I'll pay your way. I'll pay your expenses. I'll pay for the fat guy's overtime. Who's gonna run the store if okay, I go? Okay, I get it. You lost weight, all right? You look fabulous in skinny jeans. Way less like a sausage trying to break out of its casing. Pack your goddamn bag. Go, Ghostbuster. I mean, cool car, styling uniforms, and the scariest bad guy was made out of marshmallows? Okay. The Slayers have to deal with vampires and Hellmouth, and they're constantly getting their clothes ruined. First of all, the scariest bad guy in Ghostbusters was an evil god from another dimension manifesting himself as a giant marshmallow. He's so powerful, he can be the business end of us more and still kick ass. Besides, what about Slayer's superpowers? All you need to defeat a Slayer is a sexy male vampire <laughs> with soul. Or in the case of Blade, the IRS. Oh. Um, Ryan, we need to talk. Oh my god, you're breaking up with me. Oh, fine, Ghostbuster. I'm so sorry, but it's time. Time for what? The game is Cyber Run. The single most deadly sci-fi action fantasy role-playing game ever published. Ryan, this is my brother Gary. Gary, this is my fiance, Ryan. I probably should have mentioned that over there. Monica, what the hell? I thought I was getting murdered. I'm Gary. Physical adept extraordinaire. This is our Decker. Dwarven Decker, at your service. Decker? Let's put it this way. I hack computers with my mind. You leave bypassing any and all security systems to moi. And you know my sister? Yes. Hi, Monica. Let's play your knowledge, hun. Be in character. I'm sorry. What are you, some sort of eye meltingly hot elf? Mm hmm. She is playing an elven assassin, and I will play a, a street samurai. But you're the GM. And I'm also playing a character. Because I want to. Just don't make the game all about your character. Otherwise, Gary will probably kill you. Probably isn't a word in my vocabulary. Until just now. Damn. And that's the crew. So I guess it means it's time for... The, the trial. trial. Wait for it. Of, of initiation. initiation! Does that mean you can untie me now? I'll allow it. <laughs> 